So in the previous video we have added this simple movement to our player. Now in this video we want the player to change the facing according to the input. For example if you are moving to the left side we want the player to look at the left side and walk in that direction and the same for the right and for the forward and backward. So let's stop the game. Right here after we when we get the horizontal and vertical inputs let's create a float by the name of movement amount and this will be equals to mathf dot abs abs means absolute and in here we will pass the horizontal and then we will do the same for the vertical so we will say mathf dot abs and in here we will pass vertical so what this uh, movement amount will do this will simply check that if the player is moving or not if the player is moving in the vertical direction or not or if, or if in the horizontal direction or not okay then actually right here we will add a if condition and in here we will say that if the movement amount is greater than zero it means that if the player is moving in any direction then what we will do as you can see this transform dot position this just walk our player game object inside the environment now we also want to rotate our player so for rotation what we will do we will say transform dot rotation and this will be equals to quadrainian dot look rotation and in here we will pass the movement input right here so now our player will simply rotate towards the player mo uh, movement input so if the player press the A key the player will move to the left side and if you press the D key it will move to the right and the same for the forward and backward so now if we just simply save this and get back to unity right here if we click on the player as you can see the script is attached now if we play the game so now if we move forward as you can see the player is moving forward but if we press the S key the player is now changing the facing and moving towards the backward direction and the same for the left and right as you can see so now our player can rotate around in the environment and according to the movement the player will provide as you can see right left forward and backward okay so in this way you can add movement as well but now we also want the player to rotate in the direction where the camera is pointing for example if we point our camera backward we want the player to move in the camera direction okay so in the next video we will move the player in the direction where the camera is pointing okay so let's just end this video right here